Not quite escaped enough, DC. <laughs> 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 Welcome back, everyone. Uh, DC is is shedding their skin, uh, and they're fair. They're fair. Um, it was them on the recording. Oh my <gasps> goodness! Um, um, we have discovered the location, uh, or the the general location of um of a uh of a mysterious signal that has been uh that has been looked for by check out those guns you're also I'm very being, buff I'm, <laughs> right? I'm just being thane for the minute because i'm in thane spots <laughs> oh of course on. yeah this is my fault yeah it is, it is uh <laughs> yeah. let me uh, i'll work on that y'all tell thane me has no computing and nor does dc <laughs> yeah um Let's uh so yeah, while we're while I'm while I'm oh it's coming back. I owe you. Where's my arm? <laughs> oh my uh, gosh, look at this. No. Uh, oh DC. Oh buddy. <laughs> it's so cute. It's adorable. This is my life. Um and then that goes there. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Dear Zoom, please fix this problem. Right. I want to do the heat. There. I love the fact that everyone ended up in the wrong spot. Not just like two people swap places. Everyone ended up uh, ended up. Completely rotated. All right, so um, we are in the skies over a Keddy. Um, the uh, the planet below is like verdant, uh, like it's a it is like a verdant array of uh, of like greens and blues and like uh, and like um, sections of like purple um, where like the sea is being lit up by uh by like the um by the like setting sun on some parts of the planet um and and yeah you 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 um you pull in and yeah you you uh like like lock into orbit um and the sig uh, and like the signal analysis thing is like uh, uh, and like now you are getting like a um, a whole bunch of signal um, through the thing, uh, like through your receiver, right? You're getting you're getting like a whole bunch of like actual data. There appears to be several video feeds of not like there's some of like um, of like some jungle, um, just like watching the ju like it's a jungle webcam. And then there's another. <laughs> There's another that if you hadn't like been watching it for a while, you would think it was just a static image of like a cliff or like some or like like a cave wall or something, but like it's gotten darker over the last like you know twenty minutes or whatever, um, and like the light has shifted in it slightly. So it is a video feed. Um, okay. Um, there's a bunch of like coordinates um, that are like just being read out or. or it might be coordinates. It's some kind of it's some kind of like data feed, right? Numbers and letters. Um, Can we get it in pancake form? I mean, I think it, I think you're getting all of this in pancake form. <laughs> the video feeds are clearly like pancake flipbooks. Mm. Um, <laughs> um, how, how far can we stretch this pancake thing? Yeah, it says you throw the pancake up and flip it. That's how it flipbooks. Oh right, yeah. Um, but yes, so you have like like all of this information from the uh, uh, um, coming up from the surface of the planet. Um, when when like, but like finding the specificity before you like get closer. Um, like you're like cool this area of the planet. What you do? I'm tempted to ask if anyone see like over the like landing authorities system be like. Has anyone seen this thing? But then it's an expensive thing, so they'll probably 
test? No. Yo, the grappling hook is broken, right? Yes. Can we use the cord of the grappling hook to rappel down from the ship instead of landing and just like keep it hovering? Because I don't trust. Thing you can do. Oh dang! I'm just like nodding enthusiastically at that, and then I just glanced over at my character sheet again, and all this damage. Like, yeah, that's gonna happen. That's gonna be smooth as fuck. I just don't want to land the ship because. <laughs> Good call. I think it's a great call. We don't you have know lots what we of need. Power. We need a shuttle. We need to get a shuttle at some point. Yeah. That is a that is a, an upgrade that you can get. So let's just steal a shuttle. Worked so well last time. <laughs> Um, do we want to leave someone flying while we send the other people down? Do we need to, or can we just put it on like autopilot, stay in this position? I don't think it has quite that function yet. Doesn't have press pause. This is why we need the AI so we can be like, Alexa, hold the ship steady. (laughs) And play pistachio. The ship's name is Rhapsody. <laughs> just, just... I can't even say what you just said. Pistachio. Pistachio, like a like a pistachio. Yeah, pistachio, yeah. yeah. Pistachio, yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's what that is, right? Yeah. That song. About solid solid memeing, friends. <laughs> um. All right. So, I keep being like. So here's a fun thing. I keep being like, what kind of mission is this? And the answer is none of these because it's Dungeons and Dragons. Are we going in a dungeon? Well, like, it's oh, going in, like, it's, it's, it's treasure finding adventure, right? Is not one of the, is not one of the mission types. Um, unless it's like infiltration or transport. It's literally going to be your new game, Ash, that you're working on. It's, it's the treasure hunting. <laughs> yep. it's, I think it's infiltration because we're, we're stealing a thing. Yeah, that makes sense. We're doing sense. a crossover. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. In yeah, which case, I don't think yeah. Let's, 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 at this point, let's do our engagement role. Um, a little bit after the fact, but that's because I wanted you to, like, have the opportunity to choose which planet you go to, so... Um, you want to you want to give us the opportunity to fuck it up first. Well, no, because like there is a mission on both planets, right? There's a mission on Shamaya, but apparently Tintin can get fucked. So um, we need money. I know. We're gonna be in debt. I am aware. We can swing back for Tintin later. Yeah, I'm sure they'll be fine. We're not gonna be on the run from people trying to kill us. Don't yeah. worry. So that never <laughs> never happens to us. <laughs> So I think if we're doing infiltration, um, the detail that we need to know is the point of infiltration. Um, so it sounds like you might want to do some gather information before you roll the thing, because you don't currently have a point of infiltration. Does that make yep, sense? Cool. Yes. Mm-hmm. Cool, cool, cool. Um, well, how do we do I that? Phone call. Pardon? I need to make a phone call okay. in the game. Great, that sounds like a good plan. <laughs> oh, in the game. <laughs> Calling Aura. A calm call. My information broker friend. Mm-hmm. Yeah, right, cool. Um, aura, aura, aura. Is, are, are they like Watto? The, <laughs> hey, they my, what? Like Watto from, uh, from episode from one. Episode hey, my one. friend, you... Yeah, I'm. It's fine. I'm not a. I'm not a racist caricature. You want to buy a slave? I think. I think every Star Wars character has to say, "I'm not a racist caricature." Uh, yeah. If uh-huh. you're not a Jedi. Yeah. Exactly. Um. All right. So. Um. I mean, like, it's not like the evil Japanese are taking over the economy. Um. <laughs> What a what a <laughs> the little trade federation. The, tra- <laughs> the trade federation are definitely not that. Um, yeah, no. <laughs> uh, oh my god, Star Wars! Why are you like this? Why are you like this, Star Wars? <laughs> we are uh, Um. So, uh, buh, 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 buh. you want to like get onto your onto your trade uh, your information broker friend and like get information about a caddy? Is that the plan? Because they're nowhere near a caddy. Like, but they might have information yeah. about it. 
They might have something. What kind of role do you think that is? Um, getting them to give me information or trying to get in contact with them? Either. The getting in contact with them for information. Okay. You just confused the crap out of me. You threw the both at me. Yeah, I know. I'm saying, like, uh, lump it into one thing. What do you think the... I'm going to sway this computer. <laughs> no, I, I know that I need to sway... Uh, Your friend? Or a... I was wondering if it's cons I was consort. wondering if it was consort was the question that was in my head. Hmm. Consort. <laughs> <laughs> you get to choose what it is. Yeah, consort. Okay, sure. That was I think I think the idea was that was saying consorting. Right, I see. I <laughs> find I your I find your uh, your Turian way is very confusing. <laughs> DC's having a tough on. time in this new uh, this new camera spot. Yeah. All right. So. Um, All right. Tell me what you get. No. Uh, let me roll my consort. <laughs> see. Let's see your consort. What what kind of information do you want? So. I need. I, I in in my inventory I have maps and charts. Uh -huh. So, uh, I want to say that I have like a tablet. And I'm like, yo, just upload the map for this place onto my maps and charts tablet. Mm -hmm. Dropbox me. Yeah, exactly. Sure, sounds good. Send me the data. Mm -hmm. Let's roll that consort. That sounds controlled. Sounds controlled and limited. Oh, no. Five and a three. Yeah. All right. So yeah, you. Uh, oh, I know what it. Is. So yeah, you you're almost certain that you know like within uh, like a couple of kilometers where it is because there isn't because there is one um because like your readout suggests that, that says high volcanic activity and there is one active volcano that is currently having one of them volcano parties. Cool. So that's your five is you. Find is like you look down and you're like, oh yeah, down there. Can you see all the smoke spewing up into the into the sky? Yeah, active let's volcano. go into an active volcano. So it's within like, it's within a ten kilometer radius of uh, of the uh, the the big whoosh. The... That's not bad. We oh. can hunt that down. Yeah. Sure. And like. If you take this, if if you like take the the program that you're running on, if someone takes personal comms and like runs that, they'll be able to be like, duk, 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 closer, further away. Hmm. Yeah. Are y'all down with that? Sounds like yeah. a good point. Yeah. Um. Cool. Awesome. All right. So yeah. How? What? You have some information. What's your point of infiltration? The vault. Grappling hook. You're going to grappling hook yourselves down? I'm going to rappel down with the cable, yes. Yeah, and you're going to I stick think this we ship wanna... in hover mode? Yeah, I think we want to be as close as we can get to the edge of this thing in case we need to make a speedy escape. Mm -hmm. I would like to. Can we hover mode? GM, can we perform <laughs> this thing? Uh, you can put the ship in hover mode. It will burn for you through. Like, if you're doing it in at mode, like that close. It's going to burn fuel, uh, like running out of fuel is a risk. Right. Because like you're so close to the planet, right? There's so much gravitational force you're, you're fighting against. Can we get more fuel on this planet? Do I mean, I'm sure there are pirates or smugglers somewhere on the planet you could steal fuel off. Uh, That's cool. Upkeep, up I guess. Land. Do we have to helm to land? I mean, like, what, like, I want to know what, like, tell me what you do. I think we take it in very, like, to where the sensor says the signal is. Mm -hmm. So as we come in, we see, we see there's a, um, that we, we come in, there's, there are emerald blue, emerald blue green seas, um, sapphire blue seas, emerald green jungles um and like 
as we come in we see we see like the um the like the coastline um of this uh, of this like jungle hitting the sea with like black sand um along the beach and um and uh and like and we see this like range of mountains that uh that sits like along the edge of uh, of like the this continent um and yeah right on the end of like the end of the range of mountains there's this um there's this huge uh volcano that is just spewing ash up into the air there's like lightning cracking among it all of those sorts of things and yeah we 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 see the the rhapsody like you know come in under the under the ash cloud and like fly in towards the uh towards the volcano and as we're doing so we see a giant uh like um like massive like 40 meter like sea monster like l like leap up out of the water and like snap at the uh, at the ship behind them and then like <laughs> land on like crush a bunch of trees and then like wriggle its way back into the ocean let's leave <laughs> um and then <laughs> and then yeah we come in and we uh, and yeah the um you're getting like a hundred percent signal once you're within that like 10k radius so there's like the the quite rocky less uh less densely forested um like edge of the uh, of the mountain there's the there's the foresty bit there's the black shores there's the water um and then um and then behind on the other side of the um of the um uh, of the volcano there's a bunch of these like plateaus um which are like uh kind of like mesas where you get like a bunch of round flat rocks and stack them but they're like very very large right like football fields in size um and they're all they are stacked up out of the jungle as well cool can we park on one of them yeah certainly so the so yeah you, you park on them and then there's just a bit of, there's a there's jungle between you and them and, and the volcano but maybe the volcano is like it like who knows where it is around here so like we see the rap the rhapsody like yeah uh like gently glide in and like uh and like put out its little like its little landing legs and right um uh, and make a nice easy gentle landing on the um on the red stone of the uh of the mesa um uh like uh poking up from the green of the jungle below and yeah, like inside, we like everyone hears just like the hum of the of the ship, and then like the door opens, and you just suddenly just hear like bird song and like the sounds of the jungle and the roaring of this volcano. As soon as the like the seal is broken, all of this sound floods into the ship. Cool. I hate it. <laughs> um, my character canonically has an iPod. Uh huh. I'm just gonna play Welcome to the Jungle. Sounds good. Uh, I love it. Um, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. a, uh, a monkey comes up offering you a set of Connect Four and uh, and Twister. I'm gonna shoot it because here, <laughs> oh my here in the jungle, they have fun and games. <laughs> but do you have everything I want? Oh my gosh. I mean, is what you want death by, like, Adder? <laughs> Cherry's gone. Cherry's gone. I'm so... <laughs> All right. Um, so, yeah, um, you're you're on these, like, rocks poking up, uh, uh, with, uh, poking up out of the jungle. Below there is, um, uh, you, you see, like, uh, you see, uh, uh, you see, like, a, a snake, like, swing its way, but, uh, uh, from, like, tree to tree. Um, uh, like a like a gibbon, this huge long uh, like um, uh, this huge long reptile thing, and then like put out its little like glidey wings and soar down into the uh, into the water uh, into the sea. Wicked. Um, Ren starts to get her gear together, and you can see that she's quite slowly and painfully like strapping on weaponry and and gear to go out into the jungle. Should you even leave? Like you're. Oh, it's your decision. You're. I I trust and believe in you. I'll leave it at that. Uh, <laughs> Make sure she doesn't pass out. I get my big syringe. 
Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I like the fact Friend that you keep it in a labeled shit. box. <laughs> Big syringe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. So we have to climb down this mesa? Uh, probably, unless you have another way down. Um, like there's a only, there's only probably like There's only probably like half a mile or so between the mesa and the like like the shortest place between the mesa and the um and the edge of the jungle like is probably like a half mile to a mile so you're at like you can get to any of the other places with not too much jungle going but yeah you are up on up in the sky at the moment how far can i how far can i shoot with my rifle my sniper rifle well that depends on how well you roll right like oh okay but there's yeah. no like this is too far and you're not allowed to attempt this nope. that's not a that's thing. not how it works also everyone you're allowed to reset your gear so you can choose new load clear anything that you've marked off because we've been in the ship cool 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 okay how long um, is a piece of string attached to a bullet fired from a sniper <laughs> sure <laughs> it's that thing of like if you're using the wrong gun your effect or your or your position is going to be less good Right, sure, sure, sure. I was just wondering if if staying at the ship kind of counts me out of everything, but technically I could stay here and snipe, but I don't really want to do that. Oh uh, yeah, I mean like they're going to be under the cover of the jungle pretty quickly. Yeah. That's not happening. Um I think we're going to grab the broken grappling thing and just start reeling it off the edge of the mesa. That makes sense. Yep. yep. It's I'll not like functional, but it. I'm not going to be able need. to climb down, so I'm going to stand on the grappling hook bit as you're lowering it down, so that I'm like lowering down with it, so that I don't have to try and climb. I have a question. Yeah. Sorry, mechanical no. question. Go for um, it. Are we going to do the engagement roll? That's a good mm-hmm. point. We should oh, do did that. we not roll it? Oh, uh, we should have done that. Yes. All right, let's do that. Thank you, Cherry, for making us play by the rules. We talked about rolling it and then we did it. We 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 talked about it and forgot. That's what happened. Good work, good work, team. Let's see how. Let's see. Look, this is just going to determine how dangerous the jungle is. Um, yeah. let's do the engagement roll real quick. One for sheer luck. Um, uh, is it bold or daring? Yes, because it's on a techie, a ketty. Do y'all do you all feel like that? Well, yeah. yeah, there's a there's a volcano coming. Yep, cool. Yeah. Is it very complex or contingent on many factors? Uh, just the volcano not blowing up, so I don't think so. Yeah, not being eaten. Does it expose I mean, a vulnerability of the target or hit them where they're weakest? I mean, we no. suck at everything, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so everything applies there. Is the target? I don't think I don't think you've you've noted a specific thing. Yeah, um, I don't think we they do have special defenses or special preparations. So I'm taking a die for that. Um, Is the defenses snakes? I'm not saying spiders. Uh, can have you, any of your friends uh, or contacts provide <laughs> aid or insight for this operation? Yes. Yeah. Which ones? Yes. Fane um, made a call. Fane made a call. Yeah. Great. Excellent. Thanks. Uh, are any enemy- enemies or rivals interfering with this operation? We've established that there are other people who are like interfering, trying to get there first. Um, are there any other elements that you want to consider? Maybe a lower tier target will give you plus one D. A higher tier target will give you minus one D. I'm not going to take the last dice off you. Uh, so <laughs> thanks. It's okay. Because like your tier zero, right? If you if your quality were higher, you would. Like it would be less often that, that that would be a problem. Um, like this is what crew quality. This is one of the ways that crew quality is really helpful. Is that it means that you get better engagement roll dice. Um, because like yeah, keep, realistically, keep there rubbing, are like keep rubbing the salt in. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> realistically, there are like tier two people out here after this, right? So, but I don't think I don't think that they are directly. They've already been counted against you for. Uh, people interfering, so I'm I that, I don't think that should go up twice. So, um, so that's that's one dice roll for engagement. Who wants to? Okay, do we want to roll the physical dice again? 
I think I think it's nice oh, when, yeah. when Cherry Rose rolls the physical dice, especially because there's only one. Also, roll twenty does not like us very much today. Likes, it likes tin can. Yeah. What's that? I can't four. see. A four. Sorry. That's yeah. better than it. This is better than that's that's middle. That's that's only you're only in a risky situation when you land, which I think about sums up what we've described. Cool. That's pretty good. So yeah. Uh on a rock, but surrounded by dangerous jungle with a volcanic explosion above you. Cool. Everything um, is fine. This is this is the point where if Orovj was here, they'd be asking if there are animals we can ride in, but since Orovj <laughs> isn't here, then oh well. Ride in? I miss yeah. him. <laughs> yeah, like a sled. Like you know, like like a sledding situation. Oh, I Different alien cultures have different abilities, you know. Orish could just who knows right into a creature. We'll have, we'll have to I'll we'll have to ask them when they're back. So, um, <laughs> Ren, under the under the like, you you get lowered down through the canopy, and like um, and like a bunch yeah, and like you know you go down through the through the leaves, and there's a, like you know all of the um, there's all of the like the branches with like some with like some weird flowers and things and the like the bark on the branches is like like slightly moving or undulating um almost like it's breathing in and out um and then yeah you you go down into the into the like the dark and dank undergrowth um and uh and like yeah um you as soon as like your feet hit the ground and the hook hits the ground all of these like little phosphorescent worms that had been like crawling around in the like dead leaves just disappear under the ground away from you um and yeah in the distance you hear like you hear some uh, uh something like run away you know i'm cool. keeping my hand on hands on my pistols then how are you going to climb down the cable that's what i was I mean, wondering I- that's what I, I mean after. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay. We descend the cable. Yeah, cool. So at the bottom, um, like, so, yeah, you, you get down to the bottom and you're, you, like, uh, I like the fact that everyone's, like, climb down the cable and then, like, uh, reciprocity is, like, Oh, yeah. Right? Like, <laughs> you know, <laughs> Peers yeah. over the edge and just kind of hovers down. Yeah, Adorable. exactly. <laughs> just comes down. It's like that was terrifying. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, cool. So yeah, what's what's what do you, what's the go? What's how are we how are we finding this? What do your maps and charts give us, Thane? What kind of um... the, the the charts like let us know which mountain it was near? Oh, okay, yeah. okay. So Do like, we have? Um, you, you're you're now solidly in the area on the on the planet size map that it says X marks the spot, right? Like you're cool. you're on X. So one of the things on my items list is spy gear. Does that include, or can it include, like scanning slash tracking equipment, so that we can kind of get more of a bead on exactly where we're trying to go? I feel like that's not quite James Bond enough. Oh sure, okay, that's James Bond style. Yeah, 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 that makes sense. Um, I have a communicator. Yeah, you have a communicator. Yeah. I was wondering if I was wondering if um, someone was gonna like tinker uh, like a, a a like a handheld device. I like will that. plug the the beepy boopy into my uh, into my servitor skull. Yeah, that's a great idea. Do you wanna roll that tinker for me? There's a risk here to the servitor, obviously. Um, which would knock out <laughs> six and one critical. No, 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 no fucks given. Awesome. So yeah, the um, I'm keeping track of gambits too. Just so you know. okay, cool, good job. Um, so the uh the servitor is immediate uh, immediately. It's like uh, it's like I am sensing a uh, I am sensing a large amount of data from this direction and just like. Um, and like makes its way off into the, uh, off into the jungle, kind of vaguely in the direction of the, um, of the, the mountain. Um, I'm assuming you all like, just f- like follow on yep. through it. I think, mm-hmm. um, uh, as it's going, it, it like, 
it does the thing where is it physically connected to you or does it just hover around you uh tin can it's just hovers i was just checking it I didn't have like a tether or anything it's connected i have tethers oh yeah it's still correct connected it's connected to, to, it's connected to, to oh yeah. that's right so right. like there's this thing of like of like it keeps like like a dog on a leash right it's like let's go let's go let's go um Rust Rusty just like keeps getting like pulled so mm-hmm. DC, last time we had to connect it up to reciprocity so that they could communicate in a in a verbal way that we could understand. So this skull has been like floating next to reciprocity on a little like USB cable, essentially. Reciprocity is not verbal <laughs> on their own. Yeah, they need okay. a friend to help talk for them. Got it. Um, so yeah, you, we uh, we head uh, we head through the jungle and. Um, and like yeah we get to this uh um we get to this like uh this it, it's it's making its way through towards the like the kind of like more smoky part of the jungle where there's that more of that smell of sulfur and um and like it's a bit hazier and like you start seeing things like watching you from the from the tops of the trees just uh, and like whenever you like look up to like if you if you move too quickly, they, then like they'll they'll scamper. But if you look slowly, you just see like um you, you just see like these these huge eyes um and like um a kind of uh a kind of like um lizardy face um um uh like wrapped up in um uh like wrapped up in this in this like almost like a silk cocoon um and it's like they're like up against the uh, up against these like these 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 weird bark trees um and so like whenever the, whenever you like look too quickly they like re- retreat into their cocoon and you no longer it's harder it's much harder to see them against the thing but yeah there's all these like weird weird lizard things watching you through the jungle as you get as the air becomes hazier and all of these sorts of things and then suddenly there's this huge crack through the uh through the earth um and like the and like you can see some of the um some of the trees have like fall like half fallen across it and then and have caught on fire as there's like um like there's magma down at the bottom of the uh, of this crack and like the little thing is like let's go across the crack oh, like, zzz, <laughs> like it flies right it doesn't care um and yeah this 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 like massive like uh, this massive gash of like uh, 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 in the ground with like yeah like bits of tree falling in and catching on fire and all these sorts of things um, uh, um, is just uh, is like just happens to be in the way that the that the, the robot doesn't care about. I don't know. I don't know how reciprocity feels. Um, reciprocity is fine because reciprocity hovers, but um, they're thinking about their friends and. Um looks around to look for a large enough rock that they can move with their magical wizard wizardy roboty ways yeah there's heaps of those like really big orangey sandstone sort of things um around like there's like like the the stone here seems to be yeah like or like ready orange sandstone um okay so like there are definitely like some boulders around like that yeah, so I think um, I think reciprocity without even com- communicating with anyone or talking to anyone, just like kind of like stops, pulls the the little other uh, other little uh, bot back, the skull bot back, so it's like kind of like pulling on the on the cable, and just like picks up this rock with their mind and like brings it over and lays it across the gap before they continue across. Cool. Um, so what do you think that action is? I think that's a tune. Cool, cool, cool. I just want because what's interesting to me is I'm like, what's the description for a tune? Because it's that thing where like sometimes it's, um, oh, it doesn't do the mouse over thing anymore. Dang it. Um, that thing where like you can use your psychic powers to do other things. Because, like, a tune is sense unseen danger or killing intent, safely handle precursor artifacts, um, communicate with non-sentient species or robots. It's it's very much uh-huh. about... So, like, I'm wondering if it, it's... Not... It's, like... 
if you had kinetics as your as a special ability, you could move things. But I think that's you used... a special ability for mystics, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. So you, yeah. Okay, I've just misremembered it then. Yeah. So that's how you might want to take that as a special ability when you level up. Um, yeah. I've just misremembered what a tune is. That's then. that's that's fine. Because we just all go Jedi powers. Yeah. Right, and it is, but you need to take that that upgrade, right? Yeah. Can we just push the rock with our hands? That sounds like a thing you can do. Certainly. Um, does that sound like scramble or, um, like lift is the one in there? Like lift, run, jump, climb, swim, traverse harsh environments. It sounds like it's, a scramble. It's definitely uh, scrap. We're punching the rock. <laughs> Um, I have I have one in scramble. I mean, rest I have you. zero. I have two. No. I made the robot go, so you guys you can still, move the rock. Do you still have your level one harm, Ren? Uh, level two harm. I have my I have two level two harms. Yeah, so I don't so know. If either of those are getting in okay. the way. They'll be negative one for you on. Um, on an um, roll. One is stabbed and one is bruised. What do we think? Yeah, I think so. I think maybe reciprocity should like based on yeah. Yeah, I, I think I... reciprocity should give it a shot because I think we shouldn't risk Ren getting more hurt just by pulling a rock. Sure. Well, the not. thing is, she's probably going to take more stress and then she's going to pass out. She's probably not going to get physically hurt by this. Yeah, you don't want her to take the stress for a team action. Yeah. Um, I just I put a I put an image there of the kind of rocks that like I was. Cool. Well, I think reciprocity could, I mean, theoretically do it by, um, there's like a cable uh -huh. all up there with all the sure. bits that are tucked uh -huh. underneath and uh -huh. we wrap it around and give it a tug. All right, cool. Let's, let's, drag it. all right. So, I mean, it, this is, it's definitely, let me, let me double check. Cause I, I need to check what the like potential outcomes are. Um, could it be if we're could it be a rig to make the cable work good yep definitely um, do you want to do shall I do a rig and you assist reciprocity um, so you rig reciprocity to the rock and then reciprocity does the pulling yeah. It, this sounds like sense. you're doing a rig and reciprocity is doing a scramble and it's a team action. Yes. yes. So okay. rather than assisting one or the other, that's what it sounds like you're describing. Yeah. Like, so do you want to lead the action? Because I only have three stress left. I, yes, I have four left. So let's do it. Okay. What's our position? That's what I'm trying to work out. I think it, I think if it's, it what what what's your intention? What do you want this to what do you want the outcome to be here? What are the stakes? We so want that the rock to be a nice bridge. Yeah. So you want to get everyone across the thing. Desperate. Yeah. Okay. Right, because there's the there's the potential for someone to fall into the lava. Um um, Extended. If you were just saying I want to make a bridge, and you want other people to roll for their own scramble across it, then it would be it would be like much less. Um, and yeah, uh, like it's desperate, great, right? Like you're going, you're you're gunning for a great effect here, which is get everyone across safely. Okay. That's a that's a that's a three on the rig. And a four. That's a success, but with a, se a severe harm or a serious complication. Um, I feel like I feel like there's there's a thing here with like you pull the rock and then like when it lands in the thing, it like pulls on you and like does some damage to you. Um, I think. I mean, yeah, I think you. I think you get pinned into the rock, right? 
Like the rock falls in, like 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 reciprocity gets like some part of them pinned in between the rock and the edge of the, of the thing. Oh no! Not the spatula. <laughs> um, and yeah, maybe, would it be a doctor or a rig to to fix this? I mean, yeah. So if you're not if you're not resisting, then yeah, you it, it, it's a rig to fix an robot. How do I resist again? So if you want to resist that, then you just uh, then you would roll. This is a physical thing, so you would you would resist with your resolve with your prowess. So, okay, I'm gonna resist it. Yep, sure. So you just might take some stress. Five. So, so you take one stress. So you took one oh, stress one. from Cami, um, and one stress from your resistance. With your five on your prowess, resist. that doesn't happen. You don't get pinned down. Um, you make you make a successful thing. So, like, yeah, there's all of this like bubbling and all of this like uh, the bubbling and hissing and like the sound of flames from below as like bits of tree fall into the lava, and yeah, we just hear this like as the um, as the uh, and then like the as you pull your cable back in um, from the um, from the uh, from the uh, from the stone, and yeah, you um, you you all like carefully balance across the giant stone wedged into a wedged into a crack in the earth and make it across um as you do i think uh i think um you like the little the little robot the the little sorry the little servitor skull is like uh, is like um it's like high signal uh high signal density uh, detected nearby R- sorry, rather high signal density detected nearby. Um, uh, please approach quickly and with caution. And like starts to make its way off, uh, into the forest. And um, and as we do, um, I think we see uh, like rusted, like rusted and paint flaking. Um, the the robot approaches like a giant metal igloo shape in the forest like this metal dome in the forest with like a, a an archway door um and uh, um and that is like half like like half jammed open but like only like a few inches um and like um and uh, and like yeah it's approaching that being like high signal density detected and we and we see like all uh, and as it does uh, as it like makes that sound just a bunch of like um of like weird little orbs just like fly out making like buzzing sounds and like disperse into the uh, into the jungle and we'll take our last break there Yay.